Also in Royal Oak, police there need your help tracking down a man they believe intentionally ran over two people in his car. Police say it all started with a bar fight. Two groups of people got into a fight inside Jolly Pumpkin after both were kicked out. The fight continued on the street, leading to this horrifying ordeal. 7 Action News reporter Allie Hasse spoke with Royal Oak Police. And Allie, what are they telling you tonight? Well, Brian, like you mentioned earlier, that accident with the train and pedestrian happened just down the block behind me. So police were already here when they were flagged down with by an employee from the Jolly Pumpkin alerting them to a fight. And what happened next when police got on scene is that two people were reported to have been run over by a car. I think it's brutal. People enjoying their Saturday night in Royal Oak were shocked to find out police are looking for a driver that they say purposely ran over two people. That's crazy. I never would think that something like that would happen right here. Police say two groups of people got into a fight in the basement of the Jolly Pumpkin early Saturday morning. They believe once the two groups were kicked out of the bar is when things escalated quickly, saying a man got into a car and intentionally ran over a man and woman from the other group. Lieutenant Keith Spencer with the Royal Oak Police Department says all available units were dispatched to look for the car right after the hit and run happened, but it was not found. This is concerning for us that you have an individual that would uh, use his vehicle in that manner and put a lot of people in danger. Luckily, both people are expected to be OK, but now police need your help identifying this man. Lieutenant Spencer says this man is a person of interest. He may or may not be the driver. The investigation as we continue will determine that. A person in one of the groups took a video of the man, providing police this photo from the video. The driver was last seen in a gold or tan Buick Rendezvous, much like these cars on Google Image. I think uh, he needs to turn himself in and reevaluate re a few things. Now the suspected driver they're looking for is described as a white man with a beard around 5'8", 170 pounds. If you have any information, please call the Royal Oak Police Department. We have a number on our website at WXYZ.com. Live at Royal Oak, Allie Hoxie, 7 Action News.